Hey guys, it's the Turtle Lover 09. Right now we're cleaning the tank, and as you can see, when you take out the rocks, the tank becomes really dirty because they poo and it gets under the rocks. And the weirdest thing, I'm really glad that we're cleaning the tank because whenever you look, you guys probably can't see it. When you look, there are like these little worms in the tank that swim around, and I guess they're like a type of parasite, if you could tell me what they are, that would be great, so I can go and fix it, but yeah, when you see, you can kind of see, I don't know, they're like too small for people, for you to see, but if you can see those like lines, like that one, you've got it, you guys can see that, it like swims through the water, so it's like really, really gross, um, so if you can tell me what it is, that would be great, then I'll make a video connecting to this, after I finish cleaning the tank and we suck out all the water. Okay. See you. Okay. So we finished taking out all the rocks from the tank and cleaning it and putting the chlorine thing killer in it. Um I'm still wondering what those tiny things were. But I'm not exaggerating, there were probably trillions of them. So I rinsed off all the turtles, and just to be sure that there's nothing on them. And they wore gloves, because I have a cut on my hand. So hopefully those things didn't go in it. But, besides that everyone's okay. The baby is getting better. We've been giving him his shots. Today was his last day for shots. So I don't have to give him shots anymore. Unless the vet tells me I still have to. But so far she just said it was just a week. And yeah, that's basically it. Everyone's good. Still love my camera. <laughs> it's funny. The way I know that the turtles have been eating the rocks. I don't know if I told you this or not, I probably did, but I don't remember, is that I would either see them eat it, or after I would feed them in those tiny bins, there would be rocks in the bins, and I would realize that they pooed it out, because you can't really digest rocks. Well, see that guy right there, the Texas Diamondback, he probably eats, ate rocks the most. Thanks for watching, as usual, and we'll see you guys soon. Hey guys, so as you guys saw before, tank is gross with rocks and all that stuff, taking it out, and ew, parasite thingies swimming in it. After, clean, few big rocks in it, no parasites, maybe one or two, but that's, they're like impossible to catch. And the turtles are happy, hey. So as you, as I told you, they would be eating the rocks, and they would be pooing it out, and I was scared that they would be eating it like, like too big of a rock, and they'd like choke. I've seen enough drowning turtles before. So yeah, basically that's all it is. I hope you guys like my new, like, well it's not my new one, it's my first one. My first, like, picture in the beginning, it's a Turtle Lover 09. There's two baby turtles, like the... I think it was like the like the third and second and third picture. Yeah, those were Goldie and Crazy Fruit Dude the day that I got them. Yeah. They were really cute. And they were the size of a penny. And now they're the size four inches. So that's like four quarters. More than four quarters. I have no clue. But yeah, besides that, everyone's good. And if you could really tell me what those parasite thingies were because they're really gross and I'm scared that they could harm the turtles. Um, if you could tell me what they are, that would be great because I have no clue what it is. And I would go to the vet and ask them to give me like the medicine or whatever it is for it. If you could, but if you could just like specify what it is, so that way I could be more clear to the vet. Because if I just say worm thingies swimming through the water, she wouldn't know what I'm talking about. Okay, so 
Hope you guys have a nice day. Yeah, bye.